Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kritika Gurung and you all are here with me on my weight loss journey. Over here, I make weekly videos on my weight loss progress and health and beauty. So if you haven't subscribed me, please subscribe me, like me and press the bell icon. Thank you. So today's video will be week 3 and week 4 update. I'm really sorry I couldn't make a video last week. Um, and moving forward, forward, I'm also thinking that I might just make fortnightly videos instead of um, weekly updates. And reason being, it will be a bit easier for me. And also with the pictures, there will be um, you know, a visible difference. Sometimes a week to week, can't see much changes. But uh, we'll see how it goes. But for now, uh, my week 3, week 4 has been, I would say, okay. Um, in terms of exercise, um, I've been regular. So I really feel proud about that. Um, just missed once. That was last week. Um, and that too because um, I, I was on my periods. I uh, wasn't feeling really well to go to. Um, yeah, so work exercise wise i feel a huge huge difference in my strength um with the amount of weights now i am um pulling or uh, doing exercise with um definitely i see a huge change in my stamina and my energy levels now um as per um being able to do 100k steps every day i have fallen back on that so in my week one and week two i was actually um able to do quite um um like regularly 10k stuff but this this few weeks i have not been very good so i really feel like um the coming weeks i should step up and yeah probably try to fill this gap and also with my water intake it's it is four liters but then i've been sitting around three three point five ish and sometime even two so yeah I, have, I think i have to work on that and the diet part um i've been trying to you know stick close to what my diet schedule is but then here and there especially during the time when i'm on my periods i don't know i just go very hungry um, yeah, and my trainer was saying that's just due to hormonal imbalance. You do feel like, um, you know, um, hungry and all that. And even your body, um, um, your body behaves differently. Probably you will not lose much weight. You might gain because of water retention and all those things. So, yeah. So, for week three and week four, my weight hasn't changed. I'm actually sitting at 87.60. Um, I know from the last time it was 87.50, but then, yeah, I think I'm, it's okay. Uh, even if I've like gained few, few, um, kgs, but that's not too much. I guess it's just because my body is, is in this, um, transition at the moment. And also because, you know, um, although I'm losing fat, but I'm also gaining muscle. So that also plays a role. So I think I won't be stressing too much. And honestly, um, um, this month, um, this month, not sorry, not this month, but this week, there has been a shift, shift in mindset where I, I used to be obsessed over um, seeing the numbers go down on my scale. And if it used to increase, it used to make me so depressed. But I feel like now my mindset has changed. And instead of following the weighing scale as, as a measure of my... Um, of my results of my hard work i look at the strength i look how i'm performing well with my exercise um and yeah so instead of numbers it's more of now how well i'm doing in my workouts how much more i can live that thing exciting so yeah and i think it's good it's also good for my mental health um so yeah not much uh for week three and week four but i really hope that i um I do even better in the coming weeks and I really want to uh, 
Oh, follow my diet strictly, uh, which can be hard at times, uh, but then, yeah, I really want to do it. So let's see, fingers crossed, um, diet and my daily steps. Um, yeah, so let's see what will happen in um, coming weeks. Um, now I'll be sharing some videos and my some workouts um, and with some picture comparisons, which are quite amazing, I would say. Yeah, so enjoy and i'll see you when i'll see you when i'll make another video <laughs> all right bye for now thank you for watching me Ta -da!